United States, which has been a leader in technological innovation and development for many years, is believed to continue to be a leader in this area in the future as well. But there is one aspect, where the world believes where the country lags massively. The high-speed rail system. High-speed rails, bullet trains are the fastest ground-based method of commercial travel. China, Japan, France and South Korea have upgraded themselves to high-speed rail system. The fastest train on the planet runs in China with 460 km per hour. While, the fastest rail system in the US is the Amtrak Acela Express which runs at a speed of 241 km per hour. In this video, we will explore the reasons why America has not invested in high-speed trains, and why it lags behind other developed countries in this area. Lack of political will. The US government has not shown enough interest or commitment to building a high-speed rail network. While other countries like Japan, China, and France have invested heavily in high-speed trains, the US government has not prioritized this area. Construction and building cost. Another factor is the high cost of building high-speed train infrastructure. Building a new high-speed rail network in the US would require a significant amount of money. And many people argue that this money could be better spent on other areas, such as improving bridges, roads and highways. Competition from airlines. Another challenge that high-speed trains face in America is competition from airlines. Domestic flights in the US are often cheaper than train tickets, making it difficult for high-speed trains to compete. Unlike in other countries, where high-speed trains are seen as a desirable mode of transportation, many Americans prefer to fly. Infrastructure challenges. China and Japan have basically flat lands, but US does not have this luxury. So digging tunnels and laying overhead bridge required lots of funding and investment. In China, the government owns the land, so there is no issue in acquiring land to build rail tracks in straight line. Whereas America has strict property rights. So acquiring land legally is very tough. Car-loving nation. The US is one of the best road systems in the world. Since 1960, the country has invested massively in building super highways and motorways to connect the entire United States. Also American people loves cars, on an average around 850 people out of 1000 people owns cars in the US. Whereas in China, only 250 people out of 1000 people owns cars. People prefer their own cars than train to travel on numerous occasions. California High Speed Rail Project Currently, the country is laying its first high-speed rail network. From San Francisco to the Los Angeles Basin under the California High Speed Rail Project. The US government has invested around $128 billion to complete this project. This is expected to be the US's first high-speed rail system. And the maximum speed will be about 220 miles per hour. The construction for this project began in 2015 and expected to complete in 2030. In conclusion, the lack of political will. High cost. Competition from airlines. Infrastructure challenges and lack of public interest are some of the key reasons why America does not have high-speed trains. While it is possible that high-speed trains may eventually become a reality in the US, it will require a significant investment of time, money, and resources to make it a success. That was about the US high-speed rail system. Hope this was informative and interesting. Thanks for watching and please do not forget to subscribe for more content like this.